access to Zenkai LF Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And we also got unique equipment for Zenkai Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. And we've already showcased both of those units respectively. However, there is one team that we haven't used both of them on. So, today, we're going to hop into PvP and we're going to be using both of them. I can't believe I'm saying this. On GT. But this is the team. I'm really hoping everything turns out well. Anyway, let's do it. So, theoretically, GT should be one of the best teams in Dragon Ball Legends, just based on the characters that are in GT. But that's just not the case, like, at all. So, here's hoping that we can make something work. Actually, hmm. No, this has to be a bot, because these two aren't Zenkai Awakened. Like, this has to be a bot. Let's see, I'm gonna pick you, I'll pick you, and for the heck of it, I'll pick you. Surely, right? Because, I mean, but bots have equipment, right? So... No, yeah, that's... This is an actual person. Okay. Like, because, you know, bots, they'll have uh, units that can be Zenkai Awakened, but they're usually not Zenkai Awakened, right? But the one thing about bots is they will always have equipment. So, the fact that the back end didn't, you know? Alright, let's get it. Okay, I can live with that. But we saw the damage that Vegeta was doing against Goku, which is fantastic. No! Not happening. There we go. Alright, let's get it. Go, Vegeta. Big Bang Kamehameha! Uh, just gotta wait it. Wait it out. That's very patient. I'm taking full advantage. Die. He got... If he has another special move, I'm going to scream. That's fine with me. I want to key blast. Every single one. No, if I cover change, Baby doesn't have one anyway. Baby's taking these hits very, very well. Until, you know, he pops his special skill. And then a special move. Or just special move right off the bat. One or the other. And there it is. Oh my goodness, having all Blast Arts cards is easily one of the worst things that could happen. Wait, delicious! Instinct that surpasses mine. I, I need this game to throw me a bone. Because this is not it. Back off. All right, let's see. Um, if he gets perfect vanish, this is going to be really bad. All right, here we go. No, what? That's why baby's here. Okay, um... You kind of wasted your ult and your main ability? I... Oh, and I lived? Main. He came in so fast, it's insane. No. Is that all you've got? Thought so. Oh! Oh, baby's doing damage. Like, baby was doing damage against Gohan. I was not expecting that. No! <laughs> no! There it is. Who's dying? Somebody's dead. So, who's it gonna be? I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one, but you know, hey, we take it. <clears throat> like I really don't know about that one. I, I don't think that was. All right, charge. And die! He actually died. He actually died. Oh my goodness! All blast starts again. Okay, here we go. Uh, you have no ultimate attacks unless I cover change out. So, it has to end. It okay, cool. Perfect vanish. 
That's fine. I haven't used Rush yet. I'm using it now. Okay. Um, we're gonna pick Blast to hopefully throw them off. But yeah, I was like, I haven't even used Rush yet, so I'm just I'm going in. Okay, cool. Um, so there's that. I'm really surprised at the damage that my team dealt. Like, again, like, yeah, Gogeta Zenkai is recent. Yes, Vegeta did just get unique equipment, but Baby was throwing them hands. I was throwing hands. Like, I, I wasn't expecting to do that damage against Gohan. I wasn't. So, yeah, we we take that. I'm not tripping in the slightest. So there's that. Um, But again, I did think for a split second that it was, um, that it was a bot. But no, it, it was an actual person. So we take that. We absolutely do. Anyway, on to the next battle. Uh, so far, so good. I'm really surprised I didn't have to use him, really. Actually, you know what? I could have used him in that battle. It, it would have been risky because of Goku, but I could have uh, had him in, pop his main, and then afterwards rush, and they would have thrown in, um, you know, the Blue Beast Gohan, but that would nullify his endurance, so I would have been relatively safe. Okay, battle number two. Like, he literally has to go in. Like, he, he has to go in. So, uh, you're safe. Uh, I'm going to do that and him, just because I want him to be, like, you know, part of this video, but... If I can actually know, because it's indestructible and revival, so that's going to be hard to get around. Like, that's going to be very hard to get around. So, now, if they swap to Bardock, then he, like, 17 is going to have a field day, which is good. But, again, the best case scenario would be get one of these two out first, like, as fast as possible. Um, or try to focus him down. So that way, they only have those two to um, utilize. So, I would much rather get Goku and Bardock out the way, but we'll see. You cannot be serious. You, you can't make this up. You, you can't make this up. Like, the game is actively working against me. All oh, Blast Arts! Yeah, go for it, man. Another Blast Arts card? Strike. Okay, I finally got one. It's still going. There's no way! What? It's still going! You can't make this up. You can't make this up, bro. Holy. I'm just... It finally ended. It finally ended. Okay, let's get something going. Holy! Cool. Bring you in, because I know. Oh, no swap. Cool. And then all of the Strike Arts cards. This game is avidly working against me. What? What the? What was that delay? Okay, cool. Sidestep. Yep. Big Bang Kamehameha! You might be able to counter that. Yep. Let's see what I can do. There's no way he had all those special skills. Okay, cool. One revival activated. So now we have indestructible. And then after that, everybody's on the chopping block. So downside is. Oh, well. Die! I have too many blast arts cards, man. Okay, indestructible activated, sure, but I have to be able to swap, bro. Like, what is going on here? Car change nullified. If they rush, I'll throw in Vegeta. What the? What was that? This is incredible. Okay, well. That's fine, because I, I didn't even know, like, if the combo was dropped or not. I couldn't even tell. I couldn't even tell if the combo was dropped or not. Okay, so all I need to do is land one hit. That's it. Oh, 
I just need to land at one hit. I'm dead. Yep. Bam. Bam. There's that. And I got all blast. <sighs> I I don't know, man. I don't know, bro. Like, I, I can't. Like, I'm constantly getting either all blast or all strike. There's no variety. Okay, die. Popping main, because I know Gogeta's going to come in. Yep. In truth, I could have rushed right there, but it's just, it's not a smart idea because if they took the hit with them already almost being dead, it's not going to help me. So, oh, whoa. No. Somebody has to go, and it's you. Finally. Cool. Gladly we'll take that. This game was avidly working against me. Okay, I believe he already popped his main as well, so I'm kind of just anticipating him having a special move, just having one in general. Yeah, but apart from that, though, I think we're fine for the most part. So long as I get him to vanish, we're okay. That's fine. Okay. There it is. Now, let's see if the game is just going to screw me over, or... If we can actually get something going. Okay, good, because I actually was going to pick Blast. But yeah, like, this battle, I mean, on top of there being lag, the game completely worked against me. I either got all Blast starts cards, all Strike, or literally just pretty much the wrong cards at the wrong time. When I had Strike, Gogeta wasn't in. When I had Blast, like, literally, there was a unit in that had Blast armor. It was really, really hard to try to get around any of that. So, the fact that we managed to win, I'm I'm just chalking that up to just sheer dumb luck. That's literally what it was. But, somehow we managed to make it work. I was uh, hesitant on using Rush at the very end, because if they just threw out their special move, if they had one, right, and um, I just popped Rush, it would counter my Rush, right? Because it's a projectile. So, I had to be very careful with that, but the moment I saw them charge in, I was like, okay, I can use Rush. So... Yeah, that was not it, like, at all. Not even remotely, but... Either way, final battle. Hopefully, we can actually have a battle where we could fight. That would be great. Okay, um, this is not going to be fun. Actually, yeah, this isn't going to be fun at all. Um, I'm going to lead off with you, bring you in, and then you. It gives us defensive options. I don't expect any of those three to go in. So, we will see. I think Freeze is primarily on the chopping block. But, for the most part... I would prefer to get them out of the way as fast as I can, honestly. Like, of course, I want to get them um, out, but I do at least have um, coverage against them. I have coverage against them, too. But with these guys, they can keep their combo going forever, and they can constantly nullify cover change. They story already bad enough that GT doesn't really have units that can uh, cover change. Taking advantage. I mean, and the low Blast Arts cost really helped out, too. Okay, that's fine with me. Okay, I can take a few hits. Unless they have a special skill. And there it is. <sighs> There's always one with this unit. Whoa, their damage output really went down. Yeah, their damage output really went down. Cover change nullified. They're going to reset their gauge. No, they didn't. Good patience. I can't fault that. Really good patience. But I need to put pressure on this unit because, again, they're constantly getting their combo going. And because of that, there's not really much I can do. Again, I, I'm not surprised if they already have Rising Rush. Cool, taking full advantage. Alright, dropping. I'm not even mad. Oh wow, okay. But I'm I'm not even mad. Like the opponent is playing very, very well. 
Like, it sucks that I lost my ultimate attack, but, you know, I can't... Not... Like, I'm not even mad. I need a Strike Arts card. Like, I need a Strike Arts card. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Like, it's just... It's never gonna end, man. Like, it's never gonna end. Okay. I might as well just take advantage. I might as well just take advantage. Okay. I'm gonna pick Strike because I did pop a special skill, so they may think I'll just only have Blast. Here's hoping that they actually pick Blast. Perfect. Um, again, downside, though, is... Literally, I'm just getting nothing but Blast Arts cards, which is really not helping. It's not helping at all. But, um, hopefully, I'll be able to get Goku in to be able to vanish out the way. No! Okay, well, there's that. Alright, calling your bluff. And also, this will give me another vanish in the process. Either they're dead or Goku's dead. Oh, actually, they got health from that. Uh, they may live. Let's see. Hmm! Kamehameha! Okay, they got annihilated. They got annihilated. Okay, Vegeta, clean up. Oh, wait, he might actually clean up. Yeah. He cleaned up. Cool. Um, so there's that. Um, again, not really the best predicament because we're constantly drawing Blast Arts cards. Now, don't get me wrong. When it comes down to actually landing the card itself, that's fine, right? Because um, what I believe Goku had Blast Cover from, you know, uh, Goku and uh, Vegeta. But apart from that, though, all those units, apart from, I think, what, Frieza, had Blast Armor on Strike. So... Like, if Goku swapped into Frieza, right? And, of course, Goku and Vegeta, they have Blast Armor. I don't believe Frieza does, I don't remember. But, all in all, though, it just makes it dangerous to only have that particular card. Unless you're somehow able to get, like, a Strike Off first, or you're just forced them to vanish, whatever the case may be. So, the scenario that we were in constantly was not good. But, the damage output we were able to put out was good. And, through that, we were able to win. Also, having that special skill at the very end in the final battle with um, Vegeta to be able to telegraph the opponent's next move and leading that into Rush and wiping out that Frieza helped out tremendously. But surprisingly, we were able to make GT work in 2024 at the beginning of the GT campaign. But I do want to know in the comment section below, are you guys willing to try out GT before they actually start getting all the new units from this campaign? Again, let me know in the comment section below. But with that being said, I'm Itakuba, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.